Okay, here we go. We're just going to show you how to program an IntelliFlush timer. Now, as you can see, this one is in the off position. Just to um, give you the heads up, to turn this on, all you have to do is press the mode button once, and this is the start screen. Okay, now, if it, when it's in this position, to set the time, which is what you need to do first, you need to hold down this mode button till those minutes flash. Now using this plus and minus buttons you adjust the time okay, to the current time in your state or wherever you are. When you're ready to set that press the set button. Okay, Now adjust your hours okay, plus or minus whichever way. Press your set button now up the time, up the top, you've got days, 1 to 7. That's Monday through to Sunday. So at the moment it's Saturday, so Saturday 6 is flashing. Now if you wanted to change that, you just press the plus button or the minus button. And once you've got on the right day, you press set. Okay, so now we're going to show you how to program this. Now most of these come out, well just about all of them, I we already pre-programmed so you really don't need to touch anything except for setting the time but if you want to adjust the program this is what you do so when it's in this with start at the top and it's got the correct time you hold down the mode button until the time flashes take your finger off it and hold it down again until it says this you notice it's flashing str and then the number that's the timer is going to start to operate from 7 in the morning. If you want to adjust this, press the plus or the minus button. Press the set once to get across to the hours. Now again, plus or minus will adjust this. Press set again and it flashes with end time. This is the time that the timer will stop functioning, so the end of your workday. Okay, again, plus or minus to adjust the minutes that are flashing, press the set button, again adjust the hours. Press set again and it says on time. This is very important because here it's flashing on for 10 seconds. It's going to flush the urinal for 10 seconds. Once you, you can change that up or down, 10 seconds is the optimal. Press set once. Now, this is where people get confused. Flashing now, it's still part of the on time. And these that are flashing here are minutes, not seconds. So really, you want to keep those to zero. Press set again, we're still in the on part. And this is the hours zero that's flashing. You want that on zero. If you press, put that on a one like that, it's going to flush for one hour and ten seconds. Okay, so that's wrong. So make sure they're all zeros. Okay, press set again. And this is the off time. The off time is the period between flushes. So this is minutes. So it's going to it's gonna not flush for 20 minutes. So it's going to flush for 10 seconds and then be off for 20 minutes and then flush for 10 seconds again. Change it if you want to. That's fine. Press set. This is the hours, so you can set it for an hour and 20 minutes if you want to, or two hours and 20 minutes between flushes. Okay, 20 minutes is probably optimal. Once you've set it, press set. Now up here, we've got the number of days that it's going to flush. Now right now, it's there's a box around one to seven, which means it's gonna flush for seven days. Okay, just press the one. If you don't want it to flush, press the minus button and we'll take the box away so it won't flush on a Monday. Okay, we want it to flush on a Monday and on a Tuesday. Oh, on a Tuesday and on a Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. But in this case, we may not want it to flush on a Saturday. So we take that off, press set. And we don't want it to flush on a Sunday either, so take that off. Press set the last time, and now it's back to where we started. And if we were in the right time, 
it would actually go into the flush mode and flush for 10 seconds. Okay, toggle the unit on and off with the mode button, just a single press, just like that. So now that won't flush at all. Okay, if you want to, you can override the flush an easier way by holding down the set button and at the same time press the plus button okay that will override the timer and open the valve so the urinal will flush if you want to stop it you hold the set button and press minus okay all right i think you have it now good luck